<laughs> First one to the top is king of the mountain. Or queen. <laughs> Be careful, kids! I knew the kids would enjoy spending a Sunday afternoon out near the glacier. I'm enjoying it quite a bit myself. <laughs> Yoo-hoo! Nice going, Lassie! You win! Of course she wins. She has four legs. Excuses, excuses. Lassie just ran that entire race barefoot, and I don't hear her complaining. Isn't that right, girl? <laughs> what is this, Mom? Rocks stacked up like that are called a cairn. Hikers will sometimes leave them to mark a trail. Cool. So someone left this here? Not just someone, Harvey. Your father. <laughs> this... this was Dad's? Really? Oh, yes. That red stone on top? That was kind of his own special calling card. You'll find cans just like this one all over this glacier. Your dad used to bring me up here all the time. <laughs> Some days, the fog was so thick, we couldn't see our hands in front of our faces. All we had to guide us home were these little piles of rocks. I know it was a long time ago, but I can see it in my mind like it was just yesterday. Hey, check out Lassie. It looks like she wants us to keep up the tradition and make our own care. Nice work, Classy. Good dog. Oh, no. What's up, Graham? Get ready to move out. The ice is shifting. If that wall comes down, it could compromise the stability of the entire glacier. I'm officially declaring this entire area a danger zone. The foundations of that glacier are no longer structurally stable. So you're saying the whole glacier could collapse? But what happened? What went wrong? Nothing. It's all perfectly natural. You have to remember that the ice flows along that ridge are constantly shifting and moving. Glaciers weren't made to last. That's what Harvey's dad used to say every time he took me up there. He'd tell me, remember, this is all just temporary. And he was right which is why we need to warn hikers and visitors to avoid the area until the glacier can collapse and the ice can restabilize. I'll help you mark off the danger zone, Dad. Me too. <laughs> and Lassie makes three. Well, if you've got it all under control, I've, I've got some work to do. Thanks for the tea, Graham. Mom! Are you okay? I'm fine. Just a lot of memories, that's all. Now you watch yourself, and be careful out there. Mwah. Jeff, we're going to secure the glacier. Keep an eye on things here for me. Right, sir. Lassie, we're going! I couldn't help but notice that you need some help loading all this equipment. Careful, Biff. Don't want to hurt yourself. <laughs> no way. I'm here to help. Lassie, come on. Sorry, Biff. Gotta run. Thanks for the help. You're so totally welcome. So, Mr. Casanova, how did it go with Lassie? Tell us everything. Details. I want details. Well, she didn't say much. So you did all the talking? Typical for a male, but okay. Well, no. I didn't say much either. That's good. Actions speak louder than words. Yeah, but we didn't really do anything. Lassie will never notice me. Nonsense, Biff. Trust me. 
you have to do is be yourself. Exactly. Be yourself. Only it has to be a version of yourself that's more exciting, charming, and handsome. And having money wouldn't hurt either. You don't need any of that. All you need is to find something you and Lassie have in common. Well, we're both dogs. See? You were meant for each other. What else? What are her interests, her hobbies, her hopes, and dreams? Well, she saves people a lot. <gasps> a rescue dog! That's it! My great-great-great-great-grandfather was part St. Bernard. He rescued hikers lost in the snow with a wooden barrel around his neck. Uh, I think this is plastic. So what? The main thing is, it's got something warm to drink inside. Lassie's always saving everyone, right? But what if she needs help? Who can she turn to if she needs rescuing herself? All girls love a hero, even if the girl is a hero herself. Biff the rescue dog. I like it. You'll sweep Lassie right off her feet. Well, you better get sweeping, because there she goes. Oh, no! The rescue dog looks like he could use some rescuing. Yeah, if Biff is watching out for Lassie, he's gonna watch out for him. <gasps> Biff! Hey, for us! my way back. I need to get back to HQ. But you can start by putting these cones all along the main hiking pass leading up to the glacier. Don't worry, Dad. With Lassie's help, we've got it covered. See you soon. Make sure you stay out of that danger area yourselves, okay? Yeah. Got it. <laughs> to do what would she be doing here mom 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 <laughs> up there lassie are you sure <laughs> that doesn't make any sense why would my mom head out onto the glacier i don't know but we better go tell my dad go ahead but i can't wait that long i'm going after my mom but Harvey, you heard what my dad said about the glacier. It's really dangerous up there. I know. That's exactly why I can't leave my mom up there all by herself. <laughs> Harvey! Wait up! Mom! Lassie! Lassie! <laughs> Some rescue dog I am. I lost her already. A true rescue dog wouldn't give up so easily. Guys, you're here! Of course we're here. Wouldn't miss it for the world. It's not that we don't think you can do this on your own. Or, no. Actually, that's exactly it. So what do I do? How do I find Lassie so I can save her and prove that I'm a genuine rescue dog? You said it yourself. You're a dog. Use your sense of smell. <laughs> Right, one super rescue canine sense of smell coming right up. Wait, I can smell something. Yep. Congratulations, Biff. You just rescued your first sandwich. Well, at least I found something. Exactly. And if you found this, you can find Lassie. Imagine if she were in danger right now. Lassie in danger? Where? Where? Uh, I said imagine if. <laughs> Wait! There they are! Over there! On the glacier! 
good glacier. This is a job for a rescue dog. You know another job for a rescue dog? Carrying victims of exhaustion and fatigue on their back. Especially if we're going all the way up there. No worries, buddy. Climb aboard. <laughs> Thanks, rescue dog. I still don't get what my mom could possibly be doing out here. Uh, what's up, girl? Aw, oh, poor Lassie. Her nose is frozen. I'm not sure she's going to be able to keep tracking your mom. What are we going to do? We can't even see ten yards in front of us. So how are we supposed to... <gasps> the Cairns! What if my mom is just following a trail? The one my dad marked with his red stones. Of course, you're right. Let's keep following them and see where they lead. <laughs> really weird. What is? Following the cairns my father built, I feel like I'm walking in his footsteps. <laughs> Look! Lassie's trail leads right to here! Good job, rescue dog bit! Now, if you don't mind keeping it down, I think I'm gonna try and grab a quick nap. <laughs> What's up, Biff? My nose is frozen. I can't smell a thing. And with this fog rolling in, we're not going to be able to see much either. A real rescue dog doesn't need his senses. He trusts his instincts. Of course. My St. Bernard forefather's instincts were legendary. There you go. So just imagine where he would lead us and then carry me there. Too. Come on, let's go. Aww. Harvey, your mom must have had some good reason for coming here. I know. I just can't think what it could possibly be. now <laughs> okay that was a stupid question should we take? I don't know. Maybe the best thing would be to go back to... be so important that you would hey that's you and dad yes Harvey your dad carved this statue and gave it to me as an engagement present 
He asked you to marry him here? That's right. But we decided to leave the statuette here. It was our secret treasure. I couldn't stand the thought of never seeing it again. I had to get it out of here before it was too late. And speaking of before it was too late, you need to head home with Zoe and Lassie right now. No way. We're all leaving here together with our statuette. All right. Let's do this quickly. We lost it, Harvey. We won't be able to climb! It's too slippery! We're gonna need the ice pick to create steps! Do you see it somewhere? Here it comes! remember hearing you snoring. It's not my fault. It was time for my afternoon siesta. Look, it's Lassie. Lassie, I'm here. You're safe now. A Yeti. <laughs> <laughs> Son. 
hand. I'll help you. Let's get out of here. Fast. Father Saint Bernard would have done, but it looks like you don't need me again. I'd say you've turned up in the nick of time. Really? Mm. Hot chocolate. Wow. How perfect. Okay. It'll warm us up. You're quite the little rescue dog. <laughs> Beth, are you okay? You bet I am. I am Lassie. I'm a real rescue dog. I'm sorry I lost the statue, Mom. I know how much of a treasure that was to you and I... Don't worry, sweetheart. If there's one thing I learned today, the real treasure your father left me wasn't the statue. It was you, my dear Harvey. <laughs> <laughs> 